Hello friends, in this video I'll show you how to view normal vectors in Blender 2.8. Let's get to it. I'm happy to announce that Blender 2.8 stable version has finally released, so if you haven't upgraded yet I've included a link to the download page in the description below. Alright, let's click on the splash screen to remove it. Let's make an example object, uh, Shift A, Mesh, our UV sphere, or our companion sphere. To view the normals on this object, we're going to go into edit mode by pressing tab and heading up to show overlays. Click this arrow right here. Zoom down to normals. In order to look at the normals, we click these three icons here. We have weighted normals, uh, per vertex normals, and per face normals. And in order to create uh, to increase or decrease the visualization size, we just slide this up and down. Now, realize that this doesn't actually increase or decrease the magnitude of the normals that are on this object, only the visualization. Normal vectors are an important concept when creating 3D models. The normal vectors on a model affect how your objects get shaded by lights in a 3D scene. When you export a model, the normal vector data gets exported along with it and imported into your game engine. In order to demonstrate the effects that normals can have on our shading of our object, I'm going to go back into object mode. So notice that the faces on this object are flat shaded, so we can actually change that. Go up to object, shade smooth. Shade smooth uses, let's go back into edit mode, the weighted vertex. And if we want to change it back to flat shading, go into object mode, object, shade flat. Shade flat uses, back in edit mode, per face normals. Being able to visualize the normals on our model is a good way to figure out if something is going wrong, especially if we're noticing that the object isn't being shaded right. For example, in this wireframe sphere, we notice that our normals are flipped to the inside of the object. In order to flip the, the normals back to the outside, we just highlight all the vertex that we want to flip. So we can select all the vertex by hitting A, going up to Mesh, Normals, Recalculate Outside, and that will flip all of our normals back to the outside of the object. Alright, that's it for this video. Thank you so much for your support. If I managed to teach you something useful, consider hitting the like button. And if you want to see more videos like this, subscribe and hit the bell icon. If you have suggestions or questions, comment below and I'll do my best to get back to you. Hope to see you in the next video.